Oh shit. Uh, hey, what's up, guys? Um, <clears throat> all right. So if y'all are looking to uh, get a desk, like I was, so I was looking for a long desk. Um, the desk I had, it was basically this one, but it was a L-shaped desk. It was two frames and the corner piece, whatever you want to call it. And I got tired of it. It wasn't long enough. It wasn't thick enough, and it wasn't deep enough, like depth. So this is the table I went with. This is the IKEA uh, counter top, whatever you want to call it, and a uh, electric leg thing, my bob, my jigger. So as you guys can see, we do have these options. Go at one, goes up. No problems, obviously. Ring light might get caught up. Yeah, take some adjusting. I did forget to just uh, raise the LED lights. I am dumb as fuck for that. And so yeah. That was pretty much it. It can go pretty high. So as you guys can see, I am able to have my mouse pad, my keyboard, my monitor mounts, my PC on here. It is 74 inches wide, as you guys can see. So you have two options, the 74 and you have a 98. In my honest opinion, I was gonna go for a 98, but it's obviously more. And 74 was actually good enough. As you guys can see here, I'm gonna measure it with this ruler. I use it for other things. <clears throat> So, you guys know what I'm talking about. Yeah. So it measures up to 25, probably 25 and a half. I'm not sure. And that's honestly pretty good. This is a, an inch, inch thick. Put the ruler here. This isn't 100% uh, accurate, but yeah, that's pretty much what it goes to. I'll let y'all do the math. So the screws that I have here, I have an inch and a half. And I also have an inch and one fourth. Now these aren't for wood. It's for drywall. But who cares? Um, this is the one, an inch and one fourth. So you might want to go for this one. This one is, oh shit, where'd it go? Oh, it's over here. So this is slightly uh, longer. I don't think you might want to go for this one. But it is for wood. So you can get these at Walmart in the hardware section, the paint and wood, paint and hardware, whatever you want to call it. And yeah, these are the ones, these aren't that expensive. I think it was like six something for both of these. And a pack of zip ties for your cable management. I mean, it looks pretty decent from, from what it was before. You can get these at Home Depot for about $6 again, or actually no. I don't remember how much it was, but that's that. So these are the two you're gonna need. Um, like I said, this is also the leg mount, uh, the electric desk stand that I got, $209.99 on Amazon. You might be able to find some deals with Honey. But like I said, I'm gonna link these down below to help you guys out. This can hold up to 225 pounds. The longest it goes is 59 inches. And I mean, I'm gonna show you guys these just so you guys know what they look like. It does use a uh, dual motors, two of them, instead of just one. So it can hold up more, which is the reason why it does that. Um, so this is the, obviously the way you adjust it. If you hold this down, it gives you like a setting and you pick, you obviously measure it to the one you want and then you save it, it'll save you. There's a whole menu for it. I accidentally messed up the alignment on this. Who gives a fuck though? I don't care. Um, that's what it looks like screwed in. It comes with screws for that. And I mean, I think that's pretty much it. These are the screws you're gonna want, obviously. So I'm able to mount my mic stand. You have a lot of space on here. You got your PC. This is a big case too, so you guys gotta put that, keep that in mind. This is a big case. You got two monitors, and you got this whole space for other stuff. 
your whole arm can fit on this. It's very nice. Camera doesn't do it justice, honestly. Also, as you guys can see, the wood looks looks more, uh, doesn't look as dark as it is IRL. I'm happy it came in dark though, because that I was looking at a different one on Ikea and it was dark and they didn't have the, they didn't have it no more. So this is pretty much, it came in darker, which I am happy with. The price total was 268. That kind of hurt my pockets, but when you're going for a desk, you don't want to cheap out on anything because a desk is a lifetime, uh, basically an investment. So please do not cheap out on the desk like I did with this one. This desk is fucking dog shit. Don't get it, please. Um, save your money and then invest in this. So this was obviously almost three hundred dollars, and then this was two oh nine. <clears throat> Hurt the pockets, but hey amen. Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. And that's pretty much it. So like I said, I'm gonna link all this down below. You might want to go for a seventy-four inch. Now, if you're looking to get a ninety-eight, that's a long desk. I'm not gonna lie. And if that's the case, then these aren't, honestly aren't for you. This is not for you because these don't, these aren't long. It, the max is 59 inches. So it's really not for everybody. Uh, people usually go for the, the Alex drawers. I was going to do that, but they didn't have it in stock for me. And I am uh, I'm trying to get it shipped to me. I'm not trying to drive over there because there's like two in, in uh, Florida. And um, none of them are close. So they actually delivered this to me. That's how much shipping is. If you go into the store, it might be 169, but since I got it shipped, it was like $100 extra. So, yeah, that fucked me up. But I was uh, really willing to risk it. <clears throat> it didn't bother me at all, honestly, because it did come nicely. So the screws, you have two here, you have one here, and then you have another here. On the other side, there's another two. And then there's two right here, one here on the other side. And then one here and then on the other side that's the cable managing it's not that bad honestly which is why you will need zip ties if you don't cable manage your stuff it will look terrible and um yeah so this is pretty much the way i did it i am 100 percent happy i am 100 100 percent happy i cannot speak right now so i used a, a drill for these it's 2021, bro. Come on. We don't use hammers anymore. Come on now. You want to use a drill anyway. Like I said, you might want to go for the inch and one fourth screw. Or if you want to uh, rip through your wood, then you can go ahead and get an inch and a half. That seems advice. I will not link these below because don't be lazy. Get up and go get it at the store.